it doesn't have a proof of these farm trucks have these cages in the bed simply because it allows them to haul more cargo than without the external cage on the way over here i actually saw one of these guys hauling a load of pineapples but because this is thailand they modify them with volk wheels big brake kits turbo upgrades and a bunch of crazy stuff like nitrous bottles by the way later tonight they're going to set up dj booths that are connected to the audio systems and this is going to turn to a giant party before all that goes down we are going to check out the truck show there's some really really nice farm trucks on display today a lot of them have this is completely custom paint work wheels and a turbo upgrade with a shaved engine bay. But check this out. The one next to that has a compound twin turbo setup on it. How sick is that? With the front mount intercooler and the piping, and it even has a custom intake manifold and the billet valve cover. Like, there's no reason for a farm truck to be this sick. And the one next to it, this red one, has carbon fiber doors and a carbon fiber large weave hood with a plexiglass center so you can see the engine bay and one thing that thai people do really really well is all this custom titanium work so the difference between thailand and the u.s and many other western countries when it comes to farms is farms here are still ran by like small time guys they're not massive corporate organization. So a small farmer in the middle of nowhere needs a way to get his produce from his farm to the market. And that is what these trucks are for. One of the craziest ones here is this guy's truck, which is chameleon colored with white wedge wheels. His cage work in the back is all like, it almost looks like titanium. He has a carbon fiber tailgate that is also mostly plexiglass so you can see through it. In the back, he has a couple carbon fiber nitrous bottles and you'll notice the exhaust is stacks coming out the back. This truck is crazy with a twin compound setup underneath the hood. And while most of them are this style with the cages on the rear, there is one delivery, one farm truck here that is an enclosed hauler. And that's this yellow one behind me. And it's pretty sick as well. Rocking the Volt T37s with a big brake kit. But check this out. One thing that's super cool about it is it has, look at this, nitrous. And you can even look inside. It's got a nitrous bottle, a single Kirky aluminum seat, and the gauges. And again, with the carbon fiber door, carbon fiber front fenders, and a carbon fiber hood with hood exit exhaust. You also have a bunch of uh, pretty girls. Say hello to my YouTube subscribers. Say hi. What would a car event be here in Thailand without uh, pretty girls? Thank you, ladies. Bye-bye. What the hell is going on here? Are they gonna drag race with like just a ton of people in the back? Are they really? Bro, they're not going to. No way. Look at this. This is really happening right now. actually hilarious by the way the random fdrx7 here just randomly and then next to that look at this toyota pickup truck i think this is a drift truck how sweet is that thing oh hello nadia nada i said her name wrong Ooh. 
I'm in trouble. Okay, let's do this paddock wall. I want to just check out what's going on here. These events, how do I explain it? They tend to be awfully rednecky. So you end up, look, cooking out. Hello! Yeah, buddy! So these guys have set up like a full audio system to their truck. With, it's like a home audio system. And they have it all wired in. So they can have a giant party. The hammocks in the back. Amazing. Hello. Hello. They take this drag race event extremely seriously. See, look at this. This is his basically his intake that goes directly into the turbo. And the turbo will look small, but the thing is, is a lot of these guys run a class where it's restricted to the turbo size. And then even right over here, they have drag radial set up ready to rock. This is, I'm telling you, this is a serious event. <laughs> Already on the dice as well. Rednecks will be rednecks no matter where they are on planet Earth. Look at all these farm trucks. Oh man. This, this truck right here is serious business. You'll notice that the front bumper is carbon, the front fenders is carbon, the hood is carbon, the doors is carbon, it has Lexan glass on it. It has welds with skinnies on the front and it still retains the cage in the back. This is a farm truck with a carbon front end and welds and skinnies on the front. Okay, this is a truck to look out for. As you probably noticed, I would say the vast majority of these trucks are Isuzu D-Maxes. They're manufactured here in the country of Thailand, and it's like one of the most popular vehicles on the roads in this country. And well, this one behind me is extremely, extremely clean. It has the bronze T37s with a Brembo big brake kit. You'll notice that it has the carbon fiber mirrors, Inside, it has Bride Japan seats. Man, this thing is nice. Like the, the, the cage, everything's nice and fresh. So the rears, they have the smaller rear wheel that's powder coated to match the front with a Michelin tire. When the owner of the big turbo 2JZ truck heard that I drove waffle here in my electric blue Evo 9, he challenged me to a drag race, which of course I accepted. Once we lined up and the tree went green, I nailed the launch and instantly put four to five cars on him as he spun through the 60 foot and then I totally messed up the one-two shift, allowing him to freight train past me and beat me to the quarter mile. And then as soon as that race was over with, total hell broke loose here at Bangkok Drag Avenue with a massive monsoon, which is typical of Thailand this time of year. It lasted an hour and it's finally stopped raining, but the track is totally soaked. I don't know if we'll be able to continue to drag race tonight or not, but we do still have a night party to attend.
this video demonetized. I'll show you what I can and enjoy what you can see. As requested by countless of you, the CB Media Sunsets and Beer apparel line is officially back with a brand new updated design. These are available in your standard high quality t-shirts and dry fit shirts, perfect for these hot summer months. Get yours today at CBmedia on YouTube.com. The link is in the video description. Chevy Colorado was super serious. Carbon hood, carbon doors, Lexan windows, big slicks on the back, and small front runners with weld wheels. This truck should be fast. Thank uh you. -huh. 